prefab sealant pocket. Apply tape primer to membrane and outside of the projection. Allow to dry until tacky. Remove the colored release liner. Turn it over and remove the clear release liner from the blue plastic spine. Save the release liner and place it on the other side to prevent the flashing from sticking together. Then fold in half away from the plastic spine. Join the ends together by inserting the male end into the female end. Connect the ends so that the male end is on the inside of the spine. Multiple pockets can be joined together to create the diameter needed. If the sealant pocket cannot be slipped over the top of the projection, connecting the ends will have to be done around the projection. To help with installation, roll the pocket after the ends have been joined to make a more uniform circle. Position the pocket around the projection so that there is a minimum one inch clearance on all sides of the projection. If multiple projections exist, ensure there is a minimum one inch gap between the projections and the side of the pocket. Remove the clear release liner from the flange of the pocket. Fold down the flange to the deck without stretching, starting where the spine is connected. Stop approximately halfway around the pocket. Remove the clear poly you placed between the flashing to expose the overlap and apply tape primer to the overlap area and allow to dry until tacky. Remove the small piece of clear poly remaining and, beginning at the top, seal the overlap down to the angle change. Finish the flange by folding down the deck without stretching. Roll the top of the flashing down inside the top of the pocket. Roll the rest of the flashing to remove trapped air and to ensure a proper bond. Pay special attention to the step-offs and angle change. Apply tape primer to the inside of the pocket. Be sure you have primed the projection as well. Allow the primer to dry until tacky. Seal around the base of the projection to prevent any leakage of the pourable sealer. Fill the pocket with one part pourable sealer. Fill all the way to the top of the pocket and crown the center to shed water. Do not overfill. Remove any spillage from the membrane. Apply lap sealant to all edges of the flashing. Things to remember, multiple pockets can be connected together to provide the diameter needed. There must be a minimum one inch clearance around all projections. The inside of the pocket and the projection must be primed before filling.